Hello guys. I am Jihad. It is my first video tutorial with a custom system UI for UI owner B. You see that I am using custom X project modded by MD Alongit. install MUI custom system UI you need root explorer lucky patcher file manager okay let's start go to lucky patcher go to toolbox paste to android to mod to use modded system ui you have to patch your android you see that i have already sorry you see that i have already applied this patch patch applied patch applied patch applied you have to select three items and then apply <clears throat> then go back went to file explorer and you have to extract the g file which I give the below extract it set directory internal storage ok It is starting. Go back, then go to root explorer, then go to the system device root option, and the file you start in the start file, you see two files one meta info second system copy meta info and went to the root file root on your device then copy here yes then find it and change the permission to RW RW then ok then go to system then go to the start file here you can see a system file go there and you see a build probe option just copy it and paste here then change the permission to rwrr ok i will warning you you have to back up all the file you changed then go to system then you will see a folder named framework go there and you will see three two apk's and one jar file just copy them and go to system then you will see a folder name framework in the system file just go there and paste it do this for all item replace Sorry, the router stopped. Uh, you don't have to worry because I changed the framework, and for this reason, it was the file is stopped. Just OK, OK, and again go to root explorer. 
framework then change the permission the three files one service jar dot jar and the two apks framework find it framework framework then change the permission the three of to rwrr okay I change the permission to rwrr then go back and went to the stack file in there you will see a leaf folder just go there and copy the file name system ui dot so then go to system here you can find a leaf folder go there and copy it over it then go to the leaf folder and find the system ui dot so and change the permission okay to rwrr going back to the system then you will see a option try web here there are three apks copy them go to system and paste here then select sorry then select three apks and change the permission to rwrr okay then select three items then cut and paste to privates do this for all existing items replace then go back to system again then privates then go back and here was a theme this is a theme by naim rahman i copy it and uh, it is uh, and the credit goes to naim by uh, just copy it then go to system there where you find a theme folder copy it then change the permission to rwrr then okay back to system then back um you see the boot animation zip i changed my phone boot animation if you want to change the boot animation you can uh, you have to do this process just copy it and go to system system and you will find a folder named media just select you will find a boot animation zip copy it then change the permission to rwrr okay if you do not want to change your boot animation then is do then skip it i again say you if before changing those options you have to back up all your data and all the apps and files you changed be careful now i am going to reboot my system this is the boot animation i changed mm, this is awesome you will see you will see my phone is on the notification bar changed mm. and we will see 
the recent kernel mm. you can clean the rom sorry rem clear new then now go to settings apps menu default app launcher the home then back you see the experience launcher you can to home skin as you wish like as you wish okay. mm, you have white pairs apps wallpaper themes so much uh, and show we'll get a our search bar right then go to themes mm, the theme in my ui apply it now again reboot your system just reboot again and you will change the notification you see the pop up my phone down and it is restart again <coughs> sorry mm. my phone it is on mm power of this then you will see the double tap option the skin is on you do not need the power button for this I again show you it is mm, then unlock it the skin is more effective the icons all are changed the notification bar it will change Mm, the speed meter then go to settings display mm, there is a option dynamic bar mm, this is make your bar dynamic screen there security there is enable white gate you get a pop-up notification on lock skin and the new factor is go to music play a song the, you see the equalizer then the recent panel that's all you got a MUI model system now enjoy see 